Hi guys, welcome back to Calculi videos. In this new video series, I'm going to be talking about how to solve separable differential equations. And also I'm planning to do seven different separable differential equations uh, in this new video series. So let's get started. First of all, let's talk about what is a separable differential equations. So separable differential equations are defined to be this way, dy over dx equals f of x comma y. So in this case, f function is, is a function involving x and y variable. So in order to make this uh, differential equation separable, we need to factor this f of x comma y function. So when I factor it, it should be like this. It should be factored into the product of two functions. One is only involving x variable and one is only involving the y variable. So dy over dx is going to be equal to g of x times h comma h of y. So then we need to get all the um, terms involving y variable together. So I'm going to multiply each side by dy over dx. So when I multiply each side by dy over dx right here. So we get dy is equal to g of x times h of y times dx. So we don't want this h of y. So we're going to kick this out uh, across the across the uh, dy over across the side. So we're going to get dy over uh, h of y by dividing each side by h of y. So dy over h of y is going to be equal to g of x times dx. So now we've uh, managed to separate the variables on both sides. On the left hand side we have the y variables. On the right hand side we have the x variables. So now what we need to do is as a final step we're going to integrate both sides. Okay. So we're going to integrate both sides, and my solution is going to be like this, y equals um, something in terms of x and plus c. So sometimes the solution um, can be implicit, so we cannot uh, get the y variable by itself on any kind of site. So in that case, we're going to leave the answer that way. Okay, so let me show you some examples. All right. In the first example, what we have is dy over dx is equal to x plus x times y squared. So first of all, in this case, um, <clears throat> on the right hand side, the things are given in an implicit way. So we need to factor them to, to, to make this differential equation separable. So let's try to do that. So dy over dx is going to be equal to, if I factor out of x on the right, on the right hand side, we're going to get 1 plus y squared. So now notice that we have two functions being multiplied on the right hand side. One, the first function has only x variable, the second function has only the y variable. So I'm going to multiply each side by the variable dx. I'm going to multiply each side by dx, I'm sorry. So we're going to get dy equals x times 1 plus y squared times dx. So now I have to divide each side by 1 plus y squared, 1 plus y squared. Okay, so when I do that, what I'm going to get is dy equal dy over 1 plus y squared is going to be equal to x times dx. So notice that we finally managed to uh, separate the variables. On the left hand side, we have y variables, and on the right hand side, we have the x variables. So as a last step, I'm going to integrate both sides. So, for the left hand side, notice that, uh, let's remember this rule. Okay, let me use different colors. Remember, integral dx over 1 plus x squared is going to be equal to arctangent x plus c. Because we know that the derivative of arctangent x is equal to 1 over uh, 1 plus x squared. Okay. So basically, the left hand side is going to be equal to arctangent y equals, and also when you take the integral of x, you get x squared over 2 plus c. So let's say, uh, in this case, my uh, solution is an uh, implicit way. I would like to make it an explicit way. So I need to solve this equation for y. So that's why I'm going to take the arctangent of both sides. So what we're going to get is y equals arctangent x squared over 2 plus c. 
and this is going to be our final solution. Unless we're given an initial condition to be able to figure out the particular solution. All right. So in this video, I've talked about how we define the um, separable differential equations. All right. And also, I've solved one problem. So one easy problem about the separable differential equations. Please stay tuned um, about these uh, kind of equations because in the next video, I'm going to be solving uh, six more differential equations. If you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and comment. You can also put your uh, separable differential equation in the comment section that you want me to solve. All right. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.